Hello, everyone, and welcome to Friday's five-minute feature, folks, where I'm going to highlight a specific itinerary from Alma Waterways. And this week, we are going to talk about the Captivating Rhine, a traditional seven-night cruise taking you from Amsterdam down to Basel. So let me start with the Alma Waterways difference. Essentially, folks, on an Alma Waterways luxury river cruise, almost everything is included. All of your meals, all of your drinks with all of your meals, so unlimited beer, wine, and soft drinks. You've got our sip and sail program in the afternoon. All of your sightseeing tours are included. There are no optional excursions. Nightly entertainment in a smart, casual environment with uh, the onboard pool, the My Alma Cruise app, and our signature twin balcony suites. So folks, this is a map of everywhere that we cruise, but we are going to highlight the captivating Rhine, a seven night river cruise taking you from Amsterdam down to Basel with pre and post packages available to add to this cruise as well. So we will start in Amsterdam. And if you want, you can do a pre package in Amsterdam, two night stay in a five star centrally located hotel with different sightseeing tours included than what you will get on our river cruise. Now the cruise does start in Amsterdam and we do have an overnight in Amsterdam. So a great way for you to wander back into the city and explore this vibrant city in the Netherlands as well. The next day is when you're getting your touring and it's a choice of either a canal boat cruise, which I highly recommend, best way to see the city. Or of course, you can do a guided cycling tour as well in and around the city of Amsterdam. Now it is an afternoon, late afternoon sail out of the Netherlands to enjoy the stunning harbor you are sailing overnight and ending up into your next country, which is Germany. And you're gonna end up in Cologne for the full day and a late evening as well. Now, Cologne is known for their stunning Gothic cathedral that you see in the background. And you can do a sightseeing tour of Cologne, which will include the church. You can do a guided cycling tour, or they have more microbreweries than any other city in all of Germany. So you can actually do a beer tastings tour in Cologne as well. You will have the afternoon free. You can wander back into the city. It's minutes from where we are docked. Overnight cruise and the next morning, folks, is going to be a highlight. You're gonna cruise through the Rhine Gorge with 40 medieval castles dating back centuries. This is escorted and narrated by our cruise managers. So a great morning while you arrive into your next city around lunch, which is Rudesheim. So it's not all about the big cities, of course. It's some stunning little villages and towns in Rudesheim is one of my favorite, very famous wine growing area uh, because of the hillside experience. You can do a gondola ride up over the vineyards. You can do a um, vineyards tour, a number of other great tours. And again, with Rudesheim, we're actually here uh, until about nine or 10 o'clock in the evening. So again, great opportunity to wander back in and explore this little village after dinner as well. So folks, it's an overnight sail and we're ending up in our next port of call, which is Ludwig Shaven. And it's because this allows us to take you to either Heidelberg or Spire. Now Heidelberg is really beautiful um, buildings that are old Gothic uh, architecture and stuff that you see on the left. Or Spire is actually the mechanical capital of Germany. More inventions here than any other city in Germany. So really, really two different experiences. These are full day tours that you get a chance to experience along with spare, um, free time in each of these cities. So folks, you will be back on board the ship in time for dinner. And it is an overnight sailing. You're ending up in your next country, which is Strasbourg in the country of France. Now, this is the capital of the Alsace region, a very famous wine growing region. And uh, again, you've got a couple of tour options. You can do a guided sightseeing tour of Strasbourg or a guided cycling tour as well. Always free time to explore this stunning city as well, which is just honestly on the opposite side of the Rhine River to the German side. So a very big influence between the French and the German communities. Now it's an overnight sailing and you're ending up back in Germany into Breisach, which is the heart of the Bavarian and Black Forest region. So you've got a number of tours to choose from. You can go off to Breisach. You can cross back to the river in Rickveer, romantic little village where the live version of Beauty and Beast was filmed. Or you can do a guided hiking tour through the Black Forest as well. Overnight sail and you're ending up in your final port of call, which is Basel, the Swiss port city. Now it's the only city in Switzerland that touches the water. Um, but folks, if you would like to extend and see more of the stunning country of Switzerland, you can do that with this cruise with our Switzerland package. It's two nights in Lucerne, uh, including a lake cruise and two nights in to Zurich. So again, great opportunities, incredibly popular program on our captivating Rhine. So folks, please get in touch with your preferred travel advisor if you'd like to book your experience 
on the beautiful Captivating Rhinds. Find out all the dates and the best promotions that are currently available. Thanks, folks, and we look forward to welcoming you on board soon.